Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will learn about the another join operator that is start with. Start with operator, what it will try to do is whenever an observable we have subscribed to an observable. So before displaying those values display uh, emitted by the observable, it will start some values that you have given. So that means prior to emitting these values emitted by the observable, so it will display the values that you have given and afterwards it will display the values that are emitted by the source observable. So that means we are uh, prepending the values before emitting the observable. So that is the start with. So that means why if you try to read the definition returns an observable that at the moment of subscription will synchronously emit the values provided by this operator. So that means when when we are emitting the values before emitting the values displayed by the observable first it will emit the values that are provided by this operator. Then, then subscribe to the source and mirror all the emission to the subscribers. So this is the about this start with. Now if you try to read the uh, syntax of this one, so it will give the comma oriented values. So you can give the comma oriented values uh, items that you want to modify the observable to emit the first. Now if you see, let's see the marble diagram here. So if you try to see the marble diagram, here you are having a source observable which is emitting the values A, B and C. And this source observable is passed through the start with operator and it has a S. So that means first we need to display the first we need to send the value to the output observable S this one and then afterwards it will subscribe to the main observable. So now it, uh, it, it uh, displays the values after displaying the values that are in the start with. So just a simple thing only it's a di directly thing. So it will first emit the values what are available in the start with operator then afterwards it will subscribe to the main observable and it will emit the values what are the values emitted by the source observable so just a simple thing i will show you the practical implementation of this one so let's try to create nggc pages slash start with operator now let's try to add it in the operators dot component dot html here i will be adding start with and here i will use start with and in the app routing module.ts here I will add start with and here I will add start with operator right start with operator okay now let's try to implement here start with start with right with start with operator okay let's close this one and here I have, let's assume that I have a source dollar is equal to interval of 1000. So it will try to emit the values for every one second let's assume. And uh, now source dollar dot subscribe to the data and here I can add console.log of data. Now what it will try to do here? If you go to the code and if you try to open the start with and here you will display get the values 0 1 2 3 like that you will be able to see the values right now what I want to do is first I need to display the starting the interval like the text I want to display then after the whatever the values that are coming from the interval it has to be emitted so I can use something like pipe start with operator okay and I can use something like start interval okay before emitting the values i want to use like this now if you try to see the output what will happen let's try to see now let it refresh now if you try to refresh here if you try to see the values now here first you will getting start interval then only the interval values are printing now and also you can use something like comma oriented values also uh, what you can use some um, 10 comma sorry 10 comma 20 comma 30 we'll, we'll see whether it will print or not i think hope i think it will print 10 comma 20 comma 30 if it is not yeah 10 comma 20 comma 30 has been printed then only it is printing the values interval values so that means whatever the values you want to print prior to execute prior subscribing to this interval means so you can you, you can use the values in the start with or otherwise you can give an array of this one also but you need to use the error destructuring. So here you need to use the, use the three dots. Now you will get the same output. So now if you if you try to see here, you will get the same output here. Okay, 10, 20, 30 and 0, 1, 2, 3 like this you will be able to see. Okay, so this is about the 
start with the operator so it's a simple thing it's a straightforward so whatever the values you want to print prior to the subscription of this observable so you can use the start with and you can give the comma oriented values so that it will print the values first whatever the values present in the start with operator and then after it will subscribe to the interval or observable source observable whatever the source observable it has given and it will emit the values just it will mirror all the values to the output observable that's it this is about the start with operator hope you understood about the start with start with operator this is a join operator if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you